So another important consequence of the Dobbs decision relates to fertility services. Without the protection of Roe and Casey, states have enacted or moved to enforce new definitions and restrictions surrounding abortion. And there's a question of um, how, whether or not these laws were intended um, and, and if they were intended, how they do impact um, other healthcare services, including uh, IVF. Because um, some states now totally prohibit, uh, you know, ban abortion um, from the moment of, of fertilization with very limited exceptions, um, providers of fertility services and, and entities that fund those services, employers, are left wondering whether activities such as cold storage or disposal of fertilized embryos or even selective elimination of implanted embryos, which is, is actually quite common in IVF, um, are lawful under those state abortion laws.